Hello everybody, this is George with Melnix Automotive. In this video I'm working on a 2012 Lexus ISF V8 5.0 liter. Um, the vehicle has a check engine light and the code that's in the system is P0441, incorrect purge flow uh, for the EVEP system. So I started doing my inspection and uh, number one I'll show you, I went uh, to the back of the vehicle, I jacked up the vehicle and uh, I inspected the charcoal canister to see if there's any cracks and I'm gonna get my light on it I'll show you what that looks like okay we right underneath the vehicle on the back there is a charcoal canister it's covered by a cover I removed the cover there's a couple uh, nuts there are plastic nuts size uh, there's three of them size 12 and three of them size 10 that I had to remove so I went ahead and inspected all the hoses here, make sure there was no cracking or anything like that. And I noticed everything was perfectly fine. I made sure this upper hose right here, they have my light on it, make sure that doesn't have any cracks because that will also cause, cause the check engine light to come on. Um, and then everything was fine here. Next, I went ahead and I checked my fuel cap door and I'm gonna show you that in a second. I, I checked my fuel cap door here, I opened it and I checked to make sure the gasket doesn't have any cracks in it because if it has any cracks in it, what it's going to do, it's also going to cause a code like that to come up. So that was fine. So next, what I went and uh, to my engine compartment, and that's where I found a problem. Right in this area, I'm going to remove the cover. I'm going to show you where the problem is uh, located. So this might even work for the 4.6 liter, which is very similar than this. All right, so here's what I found. Uh, I removed my engine cover, and uh, right here, there's a solenoid, okay? And this hose came loose. Actually, it broke here, you could see. Just dry rotted or whatever happened. So what we're going to have to do, reinstall this hose with a clamp, back on a solenoid and that should fix our problem um, so we're gonna go ahead and reinstall it and we're gonna put a clip back on it and uh, I'm gonna clear the codes and see what happens okay as you can see what I did I reinstalled the hose because the other end of the hose uh, dry rotted and uh, it had a leak in there so I put a nice clamp on it and uh, got rid of the section of the hose that was uh, loose and had uh, cracks in it so this should give us nice seal from the line and uh, that should get rid of our code so what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna go ahead and reset my check engine light and you could do that with the scan tool or you can go ahead and just disconnect the battery cable positive or negative for about five or ten minutes it doesn't matter I'm gonna take it through a drive cycle and uh, my check engine should stay off alright guys so I came back from my uh driving cycle and uh, check, en check engine light has not returned so which is a good thing and uh, I know for sure now we took care of P0441 on the 2012 Lexus ISF it's a 5.0 liter this uh, engine's pretty much identical to LS series engine the 4.6 liter um, on Lexus's LS's um, and things like that so once again, thanks for watching. This was George with Melnix Automotive. That's how you fix uh, P0441. Sometimes it might follow with uh, P0445. Once again, thanks for watching.